Hey everybody, Jay here at Tully b &W. Today I want to show you the latest app available for select iDrive 7 models. So, let's go to apps. And here you're going to see under install apps, there's a new app called Drive Recorder. Now what that does is that it utilizes the surround view of cameras as a dash cam. So if I go here, you'll see that I have the option to record. I can see my save recordings and then I can see my settings. So let's start with settings. So there is a setup assistant so that it can kind of walk you through on how to set it up. You can allow or disallow recording. You can set the recording length. So the way that it works is when you hit record, it will record up to 20 seconds before you actually hit record and up to 20 seconds after you hit record. So here you can set in five second increments how long you want that recording to actually happen. Now, down here, camera selection, you can select whether the car records just the front camera, the rear camera, or all cameras. Recording type, you can select where it records manually by pressing and holding the panorama view button right here. You can do it with the app, or you can set it to automatically record. And what that would do is if the vehicle detects an accident, then it will start recording. And again, you can record up to 20 seconds before the accident and up to 20 seconds after the accident. So that can be your proof of what happened. So it th again, think of it as a built-in dash cam uh, right into the vehicle. So let's get out of settings. Now once you... Um, are in the front, if you hit record here, it is going to record, again, the last 20 seconds that we were just here. Now I'm going to drive around and we will record the next 20 seconds. Oh, sorry about the bumpiness. I am in the parking lot trying to be... Okay. So, I can hit show recording. It will give me a uh, time and, and, uh, and a date right here. And it will show me, right now I have it set to record all four cameras. So there's all four cameras right there. And so we're gonna go into that recording. Now I can use the iDrive controller to go back and forth on the video. So if I turn the knob left to right, then it will, so let's go to the point where we actually hit record. and then you'll see all four cameras recording at the same time. So that was me moving through the parking lot here uh, just to show you guys kind of how that works. Now on the right side, you have controls. You have pause, previous and next in case you do have multiple videos. But most importantly here, you have an export button. So you can insert a USB and export that video. Uh, again, in case of an accident, you need some sort of proof or some, some evidence, you have it right there. And then once you're done, just tap delete and you can delete just that recording or all recordings. So there you have it. That is a quick look at the new drive recorder option for iDrive 7. Thank you for watching.